Hi everyone. Welcome to Coffee Grind. This is your chill, easygoing, morning let's play show with me, Eden. And I thought what better way to kick off a nice, chill, and easy let's play channel with Untitled Goose Game. Everyone's favourite. You know, it's it's just, a, it's, it's not at all frantic, it's a chill, easygoing game where you just play as a nice duck. I mean, I'm assuming that you've, that you've never played this game before, if you think that's correct. I have, but we're going to be just playing from scratch. I'm not going to bother doing the time trials because they're, you know, they're too frantic, but I'll, uh... I'll play the, I'll play through that, the whole, I think I'll do the whole story, do all the goals. And just, we can just have a chill time being a horrible goose together. Look at all those bells, like a silly goose. I know I'm like, like a year behind the zeitgeist doing a let's play for an entitled goose game, but, uh, hey, it's still a fun game, right? I, uh, I think it's a really cool game. Um, and I've seen speedruns of this. Um, I've seen speedruns of like people using the boot to like glitch over the fence and stuff, but we're not gonna do any of that. We're just gonna um, we're just gonna play through nice and chill, nice and gently. <laughs> this game's so so lovely and 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 quaint. Um, so for those of you who don't know me, I'm uh. My name's Eden. I'm a, uh, I'm a video essayist, a streamer, and now apparently let's player. Also an artist, and I, I do a bunch of other stuff. Um, but today we're today we're a goose. Today we're a goose. It's just trying to have a picnic, a, a nice gentle picnic over here, um, because I believe get into the garden, get the groundskeeper wet, steal the groundskeeper's keys, get the groundskeeper wear his sun hat, rake in the lake, and have a picnic. Um, we're gonna do the picnic first, just because. Just because it's uh, it's here. No, we don't want the sandwich. I've already got a sandwich. We need the apple. I like the, the even though it makes no difference in speed. I always like running with my neck down because I feel more aerodynamic. Um. Again, like it makes it makes no ends to how fast you actually go. It just feels more aerodynamic, you know? Because your neck's down. And if your wing's out, you're like a plane. <laughs> so that's... Ah, no! Did not want to turn that radio on, but I suppose here we are. I think it's unavoidable, isn't it? Um, groundskeeper. You go get your radio. I'll, uh, not only will I come in, I will actually just keep you out. And I'll go the secret way, so I don't even need your entrance anymore. One thing I think this game is missing is a jump button. I mean, I know it would be a little bit difficult to implement, um, and would like break the game a fair bit. It's a lot of the things that you can do are restricted by, you know, how much you can. I didn't realize there was a zoom. No, it's my carrot. Fine, come in, come in here and get it. Yeah, screw you. Come in here and get it. Oh, beans. He, he came in here and got it. I really like the soundtrack of this game. The, the 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 vinyl recording of the soundtrack that they're putting out is um, it's what I'm trying to say. It's like it's double grooved so that it plays a different variation on the piece every time you play it, which I think is really really cool because it's like that to me says like. It introduces the randomness of the soundtrack that is like the the soundtrack isn't quite procedurally generated. It's it's picking from samples that are like context sensitive. Um, 
carrot jam uh, sandwich. Oh, I need the second part of the sandwich. Uh, it's it's picking from like bits. It's picking from like samples that are like context sensitive. It feels random every time. It feels like there's a pumpkin jam thermos radio. It's weird. That's a weird password. Um, but yeah, it feels it feels different every time. So like introducing that element into say the soundtrack, which is not something I thought they would be able to do. Um, is real cool. I think. I think it is. Oh no, he he knew where I went. I thought I could hide there. Can I? I can move faster in water than him, can't I? Can I move faster in water than him on land? Is that how that works? Look at me, I'm a horrible goose machine. I mean, now I have stolen the keys. There's nothing I have to do with the keys, is there? Um. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> and now to lock him out. <laughs> Screw you, groundskeeper. I can go in and out with ease. A you cannot. Uh, now I need to make him wear a sun hat. So I need to to. I need to nick. His regular hat. Hey, hey. You want me to you want me to stop you want me to stop dicking around with the cabbages? Do you? Do you? Is that what you want? You want me to stop dicking around with the cabbages? Ah oh, well. Don't know what to tell you, mate. The cabbages are Oh you don't you don't want me doing this with the fertilizer, do you? Hmm, well, I'm a goose. The the playing football with the playing football with the, the the cabbage is really not one of my favorite parts of this game. Like the the objects that are too heavy and too round to like pick up are quite annoying. Um, don't worry, Groundy. I'll uh, I'll let you back in. I'll give you these keys just because I need to do the other goals. You know how that is. Is that because that's a uh, yeah you can have them because that that ding is um is I assume the the speedrun timer expiring ah I mean that was the other way to get him wet. And that's not the only way to get him wet, but it's the way I wanted to. Now at least taking care of all that shenanigans that I've set up for him. I'll steal his gem. This is one thing that we know groundskeepers hate is when geese steal their gem. Because like, who doesn't hate when their jam is nicked, right? So. That's oh to do as well. Um, I forgot. I forgot there was that extra, like the graph paper. Um, uh, pumpkin and radio is what I need. I did have the radio there, but he stole it. He's got his sun hat on yet. Where is he? Where's he gone? Anyway, it's raking the lake time. Rake in the lake, it's time for the rake in the lake.
bitch. Again, not sure if I'm if I'm gonna censor that. I don't know if I'm swearing in this in this channel yet. I probably will eventually, but I don't know. Anyway, pumpkin time because kind of a picnic, kind of a picnic without a pumpkin. That's why they both begin with P and have K sounds in them. Picnic pumpkin. It's basically the same word, isn't it? And then if you need the radio. And I know the rose wasn't part of the picnic, but now it's romantic. So where's the radio? Radio. Right, so as long as I can get this to the blanket, I've, I've done that goal. Yeah. I don't know why he wants this particular flower so much. I know, and like, I know it's his only flower, but. Like I know this is supposed to be like a stealth game, but it's way more fun if you just if you just like disregard goals and terrorize the gardener for a bit. I'm gonna wait for him to replant it and I'm gonna nick his hat when he replants it. And I'm gonna dump his hat in water. So he wears the other hat. Hello, I am Goose. Good to meet you, farmer. <gasps> He's balding! Try it again, and I won't get caught on the uh, caught on a bit of wood this time. If I hide his hat over there, I don't think he'll uh, he'll go and get it, will he? He'd much rather get his sun hat, right? Honk, honk a bit to get his attention. Get the rake to get his attention. Now he's putting his sun hat on. I can rake in the lake. A new to-do list item. While I'm doing this to-do list item, I'm raking and laking. There. Uh, so now I've done uh, make the groundskeeper hammer his thumb. Um, I would like to bring a color. I'm pretty sure cabbage picnic is a goal. I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Cabbage Picnic is a goal. So I'm going to... Uh, I'm just going to walk this cabbage to the picnic basket. And if it's not a goal, we've just, you know, bonus, bonus credits. Oh, not late, Cabbage. Not lake cabbage. We don't want wet cabbage. It's the worst kind of cabbage, I assume. I don't think I've. Actually, I don't think I've had dry cabbage. Cabbage picnic. I knew that was a goal. I knew I wasn't just making stuff up. Anyway, make the groundskeeper. Actually, is there any? I assume. If there's, I'm trying to see if there's any more goals that I can. Maybe I can actually be helpful and fill his watering can for him. Uh, 
What if I actually was help was was trying to be a help for this? And tried to fill his water and kind of farm. I don't think he likes that. Um. Gotta be something with this trowel, right? What can I do with this trowel? I can just hide it. It's a bit harder to uh, it's a bit harder to nick the trial when it's literally in his hand. Um, <coughs> I don't know. One of the bonus goals is uh, bring the bring all the flowers to the well, but um, you need to unlock all the areas for that. So I'm not gonna I'm not bother doing that. Right, thumb hammer time. Ah, too early. Too early. Much like a pig's tail, I was twirly. Way twirly. And... There we go. There we go. We got the thumb. <laughs> Oh, I know what to do with the trowel. We gotta hide the trowel in the next bit, haven't we? We gotta make, we gotta make the groundskeeper buy his own stuff back. So I'm gonna do that now. I'm gonna make the groundskeeper buy his thing. By putting it in the shop. I'll, I'll put it in the shop, and then I'll go back and get him, chase him, make him chase me down here. See, she, she is nasty. He's afraid of geese. Fucking tiny little Griffin McElroy over here is afraid of geese. So, he's fine. So the plan is nick the flower to go and chase me. Is he still chasing me? I hope he's chasing me. He is chasing me. Huzzah! And then he'll notice his trowel is gone. And he will buy it from the guy. So duck under here. See, look, isn't that your trowel? Hey, hey, trowel man, isn't that, is that not your trowel? <gasps> he just nicked that. While that exchange is going on, I am going to go shopping. So I've made someone buy, but that's actually two goals in one. Um, and another beat in the first section, uh, including the goal, the the groundskeeper's goal from from the next section over. We're actually going to call this a uh, we're going to call this a session. So thanks for watching. Um, thanks for watching this episode of Coffee Grind. We'll be back tomorrow morning for more Untitled Goose Game. Have a great rest of your day. 
and I'll try to as well.